Morning, Katie. Within just a few hours of those almost unbelievable images we saw out of Israel this weekend, we started seeing misinformation spreading online about what the U.S. is doing to help. The claim that the United States swiftly pledged $8 billion in military aid to Israel, repeated in posts all over the platform formerly known as Twitter and seemingly confirmed in this White House press release. But we checked with several sources to verify this announcement is fake. It's nowhere on the White House or Department of State website and instead appears to be a doctored version of this press release issued over the summer announcing the authorization of U.S. aid to Ukraine in that ongoing war. $400 million worth, not $8 billion. The United States does provide billions of dollars in support to Israeli defense forces each year, outlined in this Congressional Research Service report, as part of a series of agreements dating back decades. Quote, Israel is the largest cumulative recipient of U.S. foreign assistance since World War II. And the White House is underscoring its continued support for the people of Israel following this weekend's attacks while detailing his administration's communication with Israeli leadership over the weekend. President Biden said, quote, we'll make sure that they have the help their citizens need. So we'll be watching for any verified announcements of next American steps. Wisdom. All right, Abby Rico, thank you very much for that report. We will continue to watch the situation in Israel and Gaza as it develops and it continues to develop. To develop. Right, remember, for any updates, anytime, just download the WSA 9 app on your phone and watch us anytime on the free WSA 9 Plus streaming app.